Britt here, aka Hands of Wellness, and you are now tuned into Behind the Desk. Hey, you're not tuned into Behind the Desk. Monty, can you dig a lot? Share, comment, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, get all the latest content. Behind the desk, I'm telling you everything that I feel from my point of view, from my side of the desk, as you can see. And I just want Facebook Live on something, and I think I'm about to just go ahead and talk about it on here as well, but I think it's just necessary. My question to you is, who are you taking with you 2020? Now, backtrack. I don't do the, oh, well, like New Year resolution and stuff, like, oh, yeah, well, 2020, I'm going to be this, this, and this, or whatever, whatever. I don't really follow the times like that. I really try not to, because... That actually makes me feel mine too, because after 12 months you just feel that you ain't do nothing. Even though you did a lot, but you feel like you ain't do nothing. You know what I'm saying? So now all of a sudden, you like, well dang, I ain't doing nothing. I got a whole nother year. I feel like you're getting older and things like that. I don't want to move like that. So I don't really count it like that. Even though it's about to be 2020, I don't be like, oh, well, I got to make sure I do this. And then when 2020 get here, I'm going to do that. Da, 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 da. I just do it. If I come up with the idea, if I woke up right now, I'm doing it. If I'm like, you know what, I'm losing weight. I'm not going to be like, well, I'm going to wait till January 1st to do it. No, I'm doing it right now. It's a life change. If it's something that's necessary, then it's something that's necessary and it needs to happen. It doesn't need to happen or it has to happen in the beginning of the year. Like, no, you're going to change and make a move. Make a move. I'm not trying to use the years as an excuse for why you ain't make no move. Or like, it don't make sense. Come on, that was mad excuses, bro. You got to... Anyway. How y'all doing? It's Uncle EJ always, your mother's brother and your grandmother's good-looking son. And your grandmother's good-looking son. You are tuned in to Behind the Desk with the People's Champ. Just call me Monty. The FOC game is in the building. I say that to say this. It's a lot of y'all who... The 2019 wasn't popping, but at the same time, you about to go into 2020 with the same people you went in in 2019. My, my question to you is why? what they do for you 2019 to make you take them with you 2020? If you were the same boat that you was in 2019, 2020, with all those people, you got to start reevaluating the situation. For real. If there's nobody, if you were supposed to do something 2019 and you didn't, and the people in your circle knew you were supposed to, and they didn't hold you accountable, check yourself and then check the people that you were around. Period. I don't need to be around people who is cool with me not pushing my music, who's cool with me not making beats on a daily basis, who's cool with me not writing songs, who's cool with me knowing that that's my dream to actually do music but i ain't doing nothing to promote it or actually doing music period and they just cool they just like oh yeah that's cool i don't need you around me if you know that's what i'm trying to do but at the same time you don't see me pursuing it now if you tell me about myself and i still don't pursue different story then i got issues i got a major issue i got a problem if it don't move like that that's when you look at it and be like, you know what? I don't want to mob with him because he don't even take his dream serious. I don't want to mob with somebody who, like if I got a dream, I take my dream serious, but he got a dream, but he's not taking his dream serious. I don't need to be around nobody. He's not taking a dream serious. I just don't. I just don't. It makes no sense to be around people who are not trying to elevate, who's stuck in this way right here. They ain't trying to go here. They stuck right here and they cool and content with that. And you being a friend, quote unquote, keeps them there. And you just cool with them staying here. Last year they was making cookies. 2018 they was making cookies started their business. This year they still only making cookies. They didn't possess, they didn't progress to pies, eggs. They still making the same cookies? We got a problem. I need to be around somebody who's gonna get me to push to make cookies with filling in them. 
or different types of cookies. You still making the same cookies? You still making the same songs? You still making the same beats? You still trying to start the same business? You still selling the same product? That's why everybody passing you, because you ain't taking your product that you have serious. And the people in your circle ain't taking it serious either. Because every time you come out with a new product, the people in your circle want it for free. They ain't paying for that. That's the people that you don't need to take with you from the The ones who always want your songs for free. But at the same time, when it's time to promote something, they ain't promoting your music. They're not letting nobody know what's going on with the cooking. Anything you got going on business-wise. They're not telling everybody about what you got going on. They keep them until they sell. They ain't nobody trying to take that. Like, what, what, what's the, what? No. That makes no sense. That, that's my issue. And a lot of y'all taking that with you, 2020. That partner, that homie, the person that you smoke with, the person that you drink with, the person that you play PlayStation or Xbox with, the person that you wake up to every single day in the relationship, they still not pushing what you doing. Now let's make it clear. I'm not gonna push somebody who's gonna push themselves either. So if you're not pushing your own product, what the heck would I be telling everybody else about your product for? But on the other hand, why am I not telling you why you're not pushing your product? Everybody is so cool. Oh, I'm your friend. Well, that's cool. We both stay on Section 8. We both on this level. And ain't even one of us trying to move up here because we cool with the here. We cool with the government paying for our food. We cool with the government paying our rent. We ain't trying to move up here. And as soon as the government say something about getting more income or whatever is going to cut us back, what we're going to do is cut back so the government can continue to keep paying for our stuff. Who said that that's poverty? Ain't no way you can take your dream with a mindset like that. Everything is under the table. I just want to know why, bro. I just want to know why. Why is it so hard for you to pick to, to make your dream a reality? Even if it don't make millions of dollars or whatever, whatever, and you got to pay taxes on it. So what? It's still your dream at the end of the day. Why? Why can't you take it serious? We need your dream. If you do hair, we need your dream. If you cook, we need your dream. If you promote, if you sell, we need your dream. We waiting on your dream. And you holding us back from the product that we need. Why is you holding your product away from us? How we doing, man? Do I need to let you out too? All right. We need your dream. We need it. You need to look at yourself in the mirror and tell yourself, I need your dream. Period. I need your dream. Be confident in your dream. Be like, man, the world would be a lot different if I hurry up and make this product that I've been working on for years. If I hurry up and get this beauty salon going, it could be different. Because I do hair a little different than other people, even though everybody does hair. I do it a little different. My setup is a little different. We need your barbershop. If you cut hair a little different, the energy is a little different in there. We need that. But you dragging your feet on it. To the point to where 
your full time job, you're trying to make that into a career instead of actually your dream. So now, your dream is part time and your full time job is full time. So now you're not even using the income from your dream. I mean, from your uh, full from your part time job, which or your full time job to feed into your dreams to make that full time. If any of your friends is cool with that, why are you still rocking with them? I ain't here to shatter people's friendships, but at the same time, I'm here to shatter people's friendships. Period. You gotta know what you gotta know your position. We ain't got time to waste, bro. We can't just be out here being cool with everybody who ain't doing no justice for us. Wasted space. We wasted branches on this tree. Period. Get broke off. Another one to grow on. It's different between a branch and a root. The difference, man. It's a major difference between a branch and a root. And a lot of y'all branches, because I'll just be breaking off. And that's cool. But you need to find out who the root is. And once you find out who the root is, which will be as clear as day, because as soon as you start doing whatever you're doing, it's important. They're not disappearing. They're not being cool with you a couple of days, and then all of a sudden you don't hear nothing from them for months on end. Then all of a sudden they disappear again, and then you hear from them from about a good week straight, then they disappear again. That's not consistency. It's not consistency, bro. Not consistent. But a lot of people can be consistent, because I got friends. That when they call me, even though I don't hear nothing like cats like Cuzzo. I don't hear a lot of I don't hear from Cuzzo a lot. But when I do, he always asks me what's going on with the music and I better be working on it. Period. That's it. He ain't cool with the fact that I'm just sitting at the crib with product and I ain't releasing it. Just like I wouldn't be cool with him if he said I ain't cut hair. I ain't cutting hair. I ain't been cutting hair in months. I'm at his neck. What bro, you cut hair. I'm at your neck if you ain't cutting hair. Bro, what is wrong with you? That's what friends do. That's who can that's who can come with me 2020. Everybody can't come with me 2020 if you ain't do nothing for the 2019, bro. Time to elevate. Not dwell and drag. Come on, bro. Who coming with you 2020? I came in 2019 with my baby, that's it. Not my baby, baby, like, mm, no, my baby, my queen. I came in 2019 with her. I'm going out 2019 with a whole squad behind me. That every time I post, every time I post something, they sharing. Every time I promote something, they with it. Anything pop off, they there on site. That's when you know you moving. When you got cats who regardless of what's going on, they shoot first, they ask questions later. I got a whole wave game behind me. That's going to elevate me to levels I cannot even understand. Period. And I haven't even scratched the surface on releasing anything. I dropped probably like two or three freestyles this year, and everybody like, oh my God, oh my God. Do you imagine what I'm about to drop in a couple months? Can you imagine what I'm dropping in January? You can't imagine. You don't know. You don't know. But you ain't heard from me in a minute. But that don't mean I wasn't cooking. Watch when January get here and see. Oh, this is what you've been doing. Yes. I'm just taking it the professional route, bro. Copyright. Patent. LLC. We're not playing with this. Not this time. Not this time. And ain't nobody in my circle letting me play with it this time. Who going with you, 2020? You better clean out your closet, 2020. You need to make room, 2020. 
If you want things to pop off for you, you need to delete the things that happened in 2019. And the people in 2019. Don't let them cats come over and overlap with you like roll over minutes into 2020. No. Get a new phone if that's the case. No. You're not coming with me 2020. Because for some reason in 2019 when I let you rock, we ain't do nothing. Nothing popped. And you stayed the same. You was talking the same. Everything that you were saying was dang near the same words every time we talked. I didn't learn anything from you. All year, I ain't learned nothing from you. All year, I ain't learned nothing from you. So why am I taking you to a whole nother year for that next year, I still don't learn nothing from you. Man, cut some cats, bro. Quit playing, man. Behind the desk, we all.